as we know we can simply have the data from our network but the searching has to be something interesting so we need to grab the data first we are actually grabbing this inside this countries list but we also need to have some data which we are not going to touch because when we firstly get the data we are storing it here then we need another list which will hold the filtered data so one more list and i will say filtered countries okay so initially this filtered countries also has all the data so uh, after some time you will get to know why i am doing this so initially countries and filter countries both has all the data okay but when we are filtering we are filtering and we are saying that filter country has to get data from all countries so countries and where where country a single country will have country name is equal to india just for checking purpose i am showing this so what i am saying i have all the countries on the countries list so i am not touching this countries list ever so we will always have all the 250 list uh, inside this countries but we are going to show everything from the filtered countries so if i if i see here we are on the list view builder we are searching with countries dot length so instead of countries i am going to replace everything everywhere with a filtered country so we are we are showing the filtered country and this countries list is just to hold all the data we are getting from the api okay so that's very easy and whenever we are changing on the text field it will trigger filter countries with a value and it will give the country which only have name as india so we are expecting only one result from the list so uh, i need to i think hot reload let's see and yeah we have this list so let's try to search so it doesn't matter what i'm typing it's hard coded so i will type anything it should reflect things it's not reflecting again you know the point we need to say set a state so setting the state like this and this time let's cut it out once more hmm seems not working what if i hot restart and typing something still not working so what's the point let's just see to debug this kind of situation firstly let's check what this query is going to result so let's print this and i will comment this set state and whenever do something here we are having the list that's good but you can see at this starting we have this parenthesis because this is not a list so to con convert this into a list i can simply say to list very easy things so now if i say any search now i have this list this uh, uh, square bracket this means it's a list so very simple thing so we have the idea how we need to do dot to list save this file and this means if i type i n or whatever i type it's hard coded it will give the india but whenever but whenever i click on this cut i want to have all my countries so this means if i see we have an icon cancel on press we are saying okay searching is false also filtered country is equal to all the countries okay that's cool so i search i have india click all the countries back to all the countries that's very nice and the last remaining thing which we actually want to search via this value so 
I can simply say value, but this has to be dot to lower case. I'm saying whatever the country name, let's just lowercase it and then compare with the value we are giving. Searching for India, it's not working. And even if we don't want to, uh, to write the whole name of the country, then compare. I want to check if this country name when lowercase dot contains contains and containing this value but this value also has to be two lower case so that we are on the same platform okay so after doing this i can simply say it will going to work why because if i search here i can type india yeah we have india i can type uh, uh, china china is there i can type anything and united states states of america and we can go there we can see the capital washington dc population is this much currency is us dollar flag is this hmm. flag is a little different uh, blame it to <laughs> api <laughs> not to me okay so this is done and in the next episode we are going to see how we can actually start with the maps the google map showing the location of every country on google map so we will meet in the next episode and if you are enjoying this uh, tutorials and this videos share this video with your friends we will meet in the next episode till then goodbye